dealing with an infection. What do we do then? Okay, Dr. Quinn. We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards Macon, I suppose. All right, then. J'espère que ça va pas être aussi chiant que dans la saison 2 de Walking Dead parce que y a que des dialogues. It smells like. Je pense pas que dans le jeu ce soit comme ça. Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Just like that. I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Hey, get up! Hey, moi je suis le mécano du coin. I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. But I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. <sighs> Toi, je le sens déjà, tu vas foutre la merde. Going, we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? D'accord, un anecdote de merde à propos de ton fils. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. Ah bah au moins, t'es conscient de ce qu'il est the word is, you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence! Well, yeah. Yeah. well, well I need a good me foreman. Up. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Definitely right. we'll hop to it. Petit con, va. La gamine, ils l'ont fait peut-être trop attendrissante, et lui, ils l'ont fait peut-être petit con. We can visit. J'arrive à mettre tout le monde en danger, ce connard. Allez, vas-y. Fous la merde. Ah ouais, non, excusez-moi, j'ai pas envie de faire un Miami avec vous. Oh, vas-y. Toi, direct, tu vas pas me casser les couilles. Je vais te montrer quels sont les bails. Direct, ma couille. How you doing, Doc? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be Dis great. If you hey, could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Vas-y, tu m'as pris euh, pour un Sims ou quoi? Fils d'up. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. 
Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... I'll get to shoot one. Get that one. I could shoot one. Maybe. If it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. Je te ravi de te parler. Toi, vas-y, faut qu'on parle. Tu vas arrêter de dire des conneries maintenant. Ah d'accord. Vous pourrez tous. Oui, Doc. Complètement con. How are these things to drive? Awesome! Pain in the ass, mostly. Big, heavy as hell, and slower than, uh... Ouais, plus lent que... Vas-y, termine. T'as des couilles. Do you, uh, think this thing will keep them out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. Bah, mon con. Tu peux pas aller loin avec tes planches, hein. Bon toi le gauf, je veux qu'on parle. Je savais bien que t'étais mécano, t'avais une moustache et une casquette. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Je vais pas eu ton t-shirt en plus. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Ah merci, désolé. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I have no idea what I'm doing. At least yeah, but... you're honest. Shit. Better than I was when Duck showed up. You'll figure it out. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government'll start handing out shots and the National Guard'll do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, ah, dolphin, mécano. whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See you. Ouais, j'ai entendu parler de ton bateau, t'inquiète même pas. You have such pretty hair. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Papa, t'as un sacré sujet de discussion, toi, hein, Clementine? Hey there, girls. Va bien s'entendre. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. I'm a professor in the police. What did I do? Yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just. Hey, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? 
You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, huh? Back back again. Again. Okay, Lee. Dans CP Clémentine. Qu'est-ce qu'on va faire de toi T'aimes pas le bac Putain. You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure I follow. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon, with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? What are you getting at? Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. What up? Go! I'll get my gun! Ah, c'est le tracteur, ça. Ah, le petit coup qu'il a activé. Qu'est-ce que... Ah, hop, 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 hop. Oh, J'ai pas le temps. Non, 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 finalement, c'est ça. Ils sont venus. Ils L'autre il va s'en rappeler. Et voilà. I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. Parce que l'autre petit con il a activé le tracteur. We'll stitch you up. It almost. It almost got me, man. It... Lee tried to save me. I know, son. Vas-y après l'autre mécano là m'a rappelé cher il va m'en vouloir parce que j'ai sauvé l'autre et pas son fils. Putain son fils c'est un petit con quoi. I wasn't strong enough. I'm sorry. 
If your girl is ever trapped, you better hope you get stronger, or your friends are cowards. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. Got that ride to make it if you want it. Ah, si c'est pour Gloat, il me reproche de pas avoir sauvé son fils. Euh... Ah d'accord, je décale, je fais d'accord. J'ai même pas eu le choix. Je veux rester dans la ferme. Moi. Well. This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Oh, that's sympa, cette petite ville. Alors, chaleureux. Look. Ah, oh, c'est juste pute de casse. Hey there, you friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Ah non, ma gueule, je suis pas friendly, j'ai trop joué à des aides. Oh, fais-toi bouffer, vas-y, fais-toi bouffer, fais-toi bouffer. Ah, merde. shut no matter what I fucking mean it we don't know who these people are it could be dangerous worse they could have let them right to us where the hell is your humanity we're not dangerous just regular folks what's dangerous is a bunch of people running outside and drawing their attention to us Lee's right we're just regular folks but we actually like helping people you'll have to excuse her the hell he or anyone will this is about survival do you guys not see what's happening? What is it? I... I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. I bet you would. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. She's the leader here, but it looks like she's losing control of her people. If you were in my shoes, you'd be the... Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Lee, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It's... Lily, I'll handle it. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily! And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things! What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten! Lee, stop this! It's upsetting him! Oh, I'm upsetting him! Upsetting is getting eaten alive! Dad, we get it. It's a big deal. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Key's behind the counter. Probably. 
Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. Too. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! Knock this guy out. Happily. Jesus! Oh, oh man. Oh. <laughs> You okay? Okay, to should visit. Just great, thanks. Uh, guys? Uh, Everybody down! Stay quiet! They're gonna get in! Shut up! Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Ah! Ouais, vas-y, on va se Allez, vas-y. Ouais, 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 ouais. ouais. Well, what's wrong with it? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Damn, that'd be great. Well, it's gotta get done. Plus, I'm quick, and I know Macon. Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. J'ai pas compris ce qu'il y avait à voir. Bon, il y avait certainement rien de voir. Qu'est-ce que t'as d'intéressant à dire? Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Ah, huh. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed.
He just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all he cares about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. I can't reach that brick. Any idea where the pharmacy keys might be? We searched high and low inside before you guys got here. They weren't on the old couple we took out of the office. Are you okay? I'm fine. If the keys aren't in the drugstore, think they could be out of here? We now live in a world where getting up and walking away is an actual possibility, so... Right. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Hey, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. <laughs> Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. Would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. Atlanta's in rough shape, that's all I know. Bah ma foi, hein. Il y a de très intéressant. How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. Yeah, I I I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. What about you? I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. Any idea where the pharmacy keys might be? No, we gotta keep looking around. Merci, tu m'as été toute grande utilité. Let's head back inside. Okay. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. Ah, t'as du bon. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. That guy saved you? Yeah, can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kind of cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Oh, huh? Well, huh? Oh, nothing. How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. <sighs> Nothing. D'accord. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I 